And hello once again, and Merry Christmas and all that old bollocks. Um, right, so this is a little bit special because 10 years I've been doing this now. 10 years I've been talking on the camera. And it was 2013 Christmas Eve, I did my first ever talking on the camera. I just thought, you know, back then, when I, well, I think this is when I also started doing gaming reviews because I did 10 years of that as well this year. So two milestones, 10 years of gaming reviews and 10 years talking on the camera. I remember the first time I did it, I had loads of beers everywhere. I don't do that, I don't drink, no way is what I used to. I mean, I'm recording this, what, about two o'clock? I'm drinking a cup of tea. Yeah, so those days of drinking and talking on the camera are long gone now because I don't drink that much anymore. Um, and I don't really talk that much on the camera anymore because I don't know. Uh, oh yeah, well, because sometimes I get, I used to do things called um, a subject request. I don't do that anymore because I've got subject requests that, that don't interest me. I'm just thinking, why the fuck do I want to talk about something that has zero interest in, you know, to talk about, you know. Someone asked me a few years ago to talk about a band that I have no interest in it. What's the point of me talking about it if I've got zero interest in a certain subject? You know, I just think, oh, this ain't worth it. Now, just... I don't know, another factors that you've got to be careful with YouTube nowadays, you know, you say something out of order, you can get your video flagged, you can get a community guide line strike or something like that, I've never had one yet, but, and also something I did this year, I pissed off um, at least three people that had been subscribed to my channel for a long, long time actually. Um, and all of a sudden I made a video about migrants, I pissed them off. You know, at the end of the day, I say what the fuck I want, you know. It, that's my right to say what I fucking well want. It's my right to swear or whatever, you know. It's my channel, I can do and say what I want, you know, within community guide, um, YouTube guideline. Oh, oh, it's all bullshit, you know. Um, used to, years ago, I had more freedom, you know, a lot of people had more freedom to say what they want, um, but now it's just like, oh, what about the guidelines, oh, fuck the guidelines, you know. Um, okay, there were certain things that you, you can't say, you know, there's certain things that I wouldn't talk about anyway that, you know, like there's certain things like medicines and things like that you can't talk about, well, I've got no desire to talk about those anyway but yeah but you know there's certain things you've got to be careful of what you can talk about what you can't talk about i did the migrant things and you know I've, no it's still still up i'm not taking it down just because some person or three people that got offended by it that's not my fucking problem i don't make videos to offend people it's the person themselves that takes offense by it you know at the end of the day that's tough shit. If you find what I say offensive, then don't fucking well watch it. Um, yeah, I, I honestly couldn't believe, you know, that I know these to come in my life, you know, when I do my outdoor talking up. And they did mention they're left leaning. And I thought, okay, you know, means fuck all to me because I'm neither left or right, you know. I don't know. <laughs> what's worse than the other? I think they both can be extreme, you know, left and extreme right. I'm not into all these bollocks, you know. I don't give a fuck, you know. I'm not into politics. And the, the thing is, what comes across is the right, you know, the far right. As they like to ram it down your throat, you know. And, you know, you're going to fucking listen to me regardless. That's their attitude, you know. With the left, they're a bit... I don't know, thick. <laughs> um, that's my, I, I, I'm, I'm just, I don't, 
get into all this political bullshit. You know, I, if there's an issue, I want to say something. I'll, say, I'll speak my mind, and everyone else can have an opinion. You know, that's up to you. You know, if you disagree, you disagree. But that's up to you. You know, you can agree, you can agree. Entirely up to you. I don't um, tell people what to think. That's the right wing. <laughs> <laughs> they, they try to tell you what to think. No, no, no. Left is that they um, they are told what to think. <laughs> no, I'm not, I'm neither of fucking this left and right bullshit. Um, yeah, so I think when they mentioned their left leaning, I thought, oh fucking hell. Um, okay, fair enough. That's that's up to you. That's you. That's your decision. If you want to lean that way, that's entirely up to you. You know, but. What I fucking don't like is when I have an opinion on something, they don't, you know, oh, you can't have that opinion. I fucking well can. I can say what I fucking will want. It's up to me. It's up to you to watch it or not. It's like, oh, like you get these fucking, you get, let's just say comedians or something, that, you know, what gives you the fucking right to cancel, cancel someone? You know, I fucking hate cancel culture. You know, what gives you the fucking right to cancel someone? No, no. Just because you don't like that person doesn't give you the fucking right to cancel that person. Um, you know, the reason why they want to cancel because they can't bear the fact that there's people out there that like a certain comedian and people willing to spend money, pay money to go and see their favourite comedian. Where the, these fucking cancel, cancel cultures can't fucking stand that. They really can't fucking stand that, can they? That's why they want them um, cancelled. You know, so you got to... Well, why should I be careful, you know? Um, yeah, it just pisses me off that, you know, because I had an opinion on something, they sort of like, oh, how dare you... Well, they just fucked off, basically. They just unsubscribed to my channel and fucked off. You know, when I confronted them, they said they were really offended of what I said about the migrants. Oh dear, oh dear, because I had an opinion. I can see what's, you know, see what's going on in the world. I had an opinion on it. Oh God, because I had an opinion on it. Oh, that upset some people, didn't it? Oh fucking well, get over it. That's what I say. You know, as I said, if you don't like what I say, don't fucking watch the video. Simple as that, isn't it? Yeah, so here we go. I'm off at a tangent and I rant again. Um, but, you know, that's what these talking on the camera is all about. I'm supposed to be talking about the last 10 years, aren't I? No, 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 that's not what it's about, you know. It's just, you know, things are sort of changed now, you know. What, what I did back then I used to do more talking on the cameras and we used to do things like uh, oh, what's that thing called video response you know a certain topic or something like a game or something um, Novabug used to um, do these Friday foursomes um, yeah it was years ago when I don't know I think there is that community still there but I don't it just seems different now you know um, I think everyone's moving on with their own stuff now, but you know that's when I when I first done the game reviews. It was just this what inspired me to do talking on the camera. You know, I saw like the likes of Nova Bug, uh, Matt. I don't know what's happened to Matt. Um, oh, what's his name? Matt. His name's Matt. You know, someone else I met. It was a few people that did these talking on the cameras, and it was, this is as I said, this was the reason why I did it because. You know, everyone else was on the camera talking about their experience and all this. So I thought, well, you know what? I'm going to fucking have a go at this. And yeah, so 10 years ago. <laughs> oh, look, cat's woken up. Well, I woke you up, cat. If she does is sleep. Anyway. Yeah. So there's some of the reasons why I don't really do a lot of talking on the camera anymore, you know. Unless there's uh, something that specific comes up and I want to talk about it. You know, as I said, the, the subject requests, I just thought, okay, there was some that interested me. There was a lot that didn't. And I just think, why the fuck do you want me to talk about it if I've got zero interest in this subject? So this is why I stopped doing the um, subject requests, because really it's pointless for me to do it. Um, yeah, but it's, 
it's, it was all right at the time, but things just move on. I mean, I used to do live streams. I've, I've stopped doing now. I've had enough of them. And now I'm getting people saying, oh, are you going to bring back the live streams? No, not the gaming live streams or the talking live streams when I'm inside. I, I, I don't want to. I'm, I'm done with that now, you know. I think it ain't just me. I think there was a lot back in, like, the... Uh, the you know the pandemic times there was a load of us um doing live streams there was me there was i think taxi yellow belly um i think nova bug and zypho still do theirs but there was quite a few different people doing different live streams i was doing it on a saturday my game live stream that i stopped doing that in, i think it's 2020 i stopped doing it you know i got to 100 don't want to do it. I don't honestly miss doing it. You know, it's a lot of fucking about getting it wound. Then you got to fucking have, then you get trolls coming on. Sometimes it was, you know, a lot of the times I really enjoyed the interaction, especially the quiz night part when it got. Oh, to me that was more fun because used to have a drink and have a laugh. But as I said, I've, I've cut right back on drinking now, so I just and I just can't be bothered setting it all back up again. I don't have software that I did have and I can't be bothered setting up all the emulations for it again you know when my computer got obviously last year when my channel got hacked I reinstalled my computer I didn't put a lot of things back on like OBS you know I need OBS to get the live streams work but I just can't be fucked with it anymore so people do keep asking but no I'm not bringing back the live streams only only the outdoor ones I'm going to keep doing. Because I like doing that. Because I'm going for a walk and if people come on I can have a chat with them. Yeah, it's easy to set up, you know. There's no fucking about. I enjoy having a walk around, having a chat with people. You know, so I'll I'll probably keep doing that. There's the only live streams I'm going to do. Um, as well, I won't talk about next year just yet because I'm going to be doing a New Year's, probably talking on the talking New Year's as well. Um, so I'll probably talk more about what's going to be going on next year. But this is really just a 10 year thing. Um, well, I've been doing this for 10 years, so um, I mean, there'll be, be a few subjects that come up here and there. I want to do more like movie chats, uh, gaming nostalgia is something else I like doing. Got to, I want to do some more of those probably next year. Um, some other bits and pieces, um, but we just play it by ear at the moment. Um, but yeah, so it's the reason why I don't really do so many talking on the cameras anymore. Um, just here and there I might do one. Um, but you know, we'll just see, you know. Anyway, you know, it's basically it's a Christmas Eve thing, so all have a good Christmas and a new year. You know, 2024 already and something else big is going to happen next year for me. I'll be turning the big Hawaii 5 ho Oh, the, yeah, 50. Oh, fucking hell. Um, yeah, I'm not looking forward to that. <laughs> oh dear, oh dear. We all got to get old, didn't we? Oh uh, well. Anyway, you know. So this is the ten, ten years of talking on the camera. Yeah. Anyway, have a good Christmas, everyone. Till next time, and goodbye.